you are on the uh, Screamer 10 4G. Uh, what do you think? Powerful, powerful kite. I just jumped off my 15 to a 10, so, and I'm wound, so it's good. I like it. When I do the my transitions, maybe it's a little bit light there for a second. It takes me a pump or two, but I'm going from my 15 down to the 10, and I'm totally powered. So. How much do you think it's blowing? What do you think it's blowing? Maybe, you know, 17 to 20, maybe? Maybe a tad over 20. And you want your 15 out there? <laughs> What kind of 15 do you have? Are you sure it's a 15? Yeah, it's blowing between a 15, 16 to maybe gust 20. Yeah, yeah, that's about right. And this thing jumps super good. So uh, I want to go jump it some more. So you guys are back. You were here yesterday, correct? Yes, we were. <laughs> Trying out the... Uh... The Renegade and the Screamer. So now you're trying the uh, Renegade 11, smaller size. It's windier today. Uh, what do you think about the Renegade uh, 11? Uh, smaller size, turns excellent. Uh, if I wouldn't find this Renegade 11, I'd be on my 14 Ozone. So you like it? I mean, what about the stability? You've been on it for like 20 minutes. Yeah, very stable. Hadn't even come close to dropping it out of the sky yet. Uh, turning's a lot better than the 13 meter Renegade. And it's a fast kite, fun kite. Uh, have you tried? Uh, you haven't tried the uh, Screamer 10, correct? I've not tried the Screamer 10. I'm sure it has just as much power. Uh, yeah. So um, let, let's put you on the Screamer 10 and the Screamer 12, so to get an idea. All right. Let's I think, do it. I think your buddy's there too. I mean, he was there uh, last night too, yesterday. He was. He was out here riding the same kites as I was. Okay. Perfect. So let's check it. All right. Let's do it. So. Uh, you're the, you're you're the other guy's friend, correct? Yeah. <laughs> you guys were here yesterday. That's right. I got to fly the Screamer 14 yesterday. We just got done flying the 12. It's the it, winds picked up today, and it's it's so sweet. They call it epic for a reason. It's so awesome. So what do you think about the power, the speed, and the hang time of the Screamer 12? Hey, I'm overpowered today. I don't know what it's doing, but I mean, I usually fly a best 12, and I'd normally be fighting for power. <laughs> Yeah, right now it's blowing, I'll say maybe uh, 16, 17 to 22. I mean, it's, I got plenty of power. I'm on, I'm on an epic board, but I mean, this, this kite is sweet. Perfect, so uh, you need to try now the Renegade uh, 11 and the Screamer 10. Will do. Okay, so you, did you try the, yeah, you won the Screamer 12, Renegade 11, Screamer 10, what do you think? This Screamer 10 is awesome. I can't believe how much power it has. It's it's so fast. I mean, this thing is sweet. Oh, I love it. I love it, man. It's so awesome. Wow, it's hey, like hey. you just got a candy here. <laughs> hey, I just, I boosted so big and I crashed, but a uh, good thing is this thing relaunches like a charm, so. <laughs> so do you like the Screamer 12 or Screamer 10? I'm gonna have to say the 10. <laughs> I like the turning ability, but hey, they're both awesome. What about the Renegade 11? That's, I, I need to get back on that one. I want to try it again, but uh, hey. Man, that was so awesome. So what do you think about the uh, Renegade 11? Okay, well I was just on the Screamer 10, which is a super powerful kite. This one, this is a Renegade 11, not quite as powerful as the Screamer, which is probably a good twin tip, you know, back and forth kite. This thing's got a totally different feel, a much lighter touch and uh, a little floatier in a way, but uh, yeah, it's awesome. I mean, what about the turning speed? Which one do you think is faster? Well, yeah, I think the turning speed on this one is definitely faster, probably better in the waves, I'm sure. I yeah, mean, yeah. well, that's the reason that we have a setting on the leading edge that you can uh, set it up a free ride and a wave ride. Okay, I have no idea what setting it's on right now, but... Uh, it's on the free ride. Right, okay, well, it's all fun. It's all good. Yeah, I think the, the Screamer 10 probably has the power of a 12. It's, it's uh, powered. I was wound up out there. Wow, that was a nice hang time. Now, do you understand what I'm saying about the hang time? This is the kite I need. Why? Ah, uh, no, I need a good, I need a good upwind flat water twin tip kite, 11 or 12. The so what do you think about this Screamer 12? No, I like the Screamer 12. I actually like it better than the 10. It's uh, just a little bit, little floatier. 
Yeah, no, it's good. It's well, that's good. because it's a size 12 and the other one, the Screamer 10, is a size 10. <laughs> yeah, okay, I got it. Man, you're lit. That's power. That's real power. Plenty of hang time. Took me off my board, just straight up in the air. So uh, you tried again the uh, Renegade 11 4G, and what do you think? Hey, I think this is the most awesome kite I've ever flown. I went higher and faster than I've ever been today. But I, you said that you like the Screamer 10 better. Hey, well, what this, happened? Hey, I don't know what it is, but. Uh, Something about this kite, it's just so smooth. It turns it turns about as quick as that 10, but I swear it's just the boost and the pop. It's, it's just awesome. So you like the Renegade 11 better Renegade, than the Screamer 10? I think so, yeah, for sure. I think I spoke too soon on that Screamer. The, all these kites, they don't call them epic for nothing. They're sick. <laughs> so um, you tried the uh, Screamer 12, uh, Screamer 10, Renegade 11. You love the Screamer, and now what do you think about the Renegade 11? You went back on the Renegade 11 again, 4G. Uh, I think this is my favorite kite by far today. Really? <laughs> I thought the Screamer was. The Screamer had plenty of power, but this thing, for some reason, it just connects. I can uh, do anything I want to do on it. It's got plenty of pop, plenty of, plenty of pull when I throw it. It's, this is an awesome kite. Yeah, it's, it's the Renegade. It's the all-around kite. I mean, uh, it's, it's good for everything. Yeah, I'm ready to uh, change that bridle up and put it as a surf style and see what that's like. <laughs> there we go. I guess you need some wave now. Yeah, wave or no wave. <laughs> Great. Cool. Well, thank you. Thank you, Dimitri. This is not epic. What am I doing with this? This is epic. I'm holding the wrong kite. Are you ready? So uh, you are using the Renegade 9, and what do you think? Oh, I love it. Great low end, uh, but awesome, awesome in the chop and everything. It's, it's a great kite. Uh, do, you, uh, do you have another kite? Do you, uh, do you own another kite? Not anymore. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, I guess that sums it up. Okay, talk to you soon. As you can see, the kite stops on themselves. I mean, look at all those people that they bought the kite. Most of them don't even want to go back on their own gear. So again, you know, all you have to do is demo those kites and you'll see what they're all about. And that's the reason why I'm doing all those demos because I'm not afraid. I know the end results of these kites. Okay, let's go back.